happened is just like a normal day. We was crossing the tracks, like every car, and it was it was bumper to bumper traffic, and it was cars still on the track. And as we um we was waiting on the light, the, we heard the train coming. So we hear the train coming. So everybody realizing that we need to get everybody off the track. So we we going up forward to get everybody off the track. And as soon as we we scoot up. The train come and smash the last car, and it caused the accident that we see today. They hit my car, or two cars down, and it's like it scared me, like being in an accident, and I wanted to be like there, just trying to just go to work like a normal person. It was frightening. Yeah, but fortunately, you don't have any injuries. How how are you feeling? I'm, I'm feeling fine. And I'm gladly that I'm alive. But I hope everybody that's in, that was in the car accident was okay. Like it was a kid, he got a scratch, and we actually seen somebody get through from the car. And I hope everybody and all their families are okay. Yeah, no, Birmingham Fire and Rescue did tell us that mm -hmm. there were people transport transported to the hospital, but mm -hmm. with non-life-threatening injuries. Mm -hmm. So, can you tell me about a little bit more about that? You said you saw someone get yeah. thrown out of the yeah, car. Yeah, one of the family. um one of the person that was in the, the car that got hit by the train, he got through in front of our car, like literally through out uh, and all that. So, if I guess the window was down, if the window was up, it could have been worse than what it is because he would his head would have probably hit the window. Oh man, and yeah. his car was hit by the train. Yeah, that's the car that got hit by the train. And, so it was scary. Gosh. So just for someone seeing this, you've never seen anything like this before. Not, How not, are you feeling right now? Uh, it, it's, it's shocking to see it like you know, like real. When you see it on TV or you see it in a movie, you 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 take a different um, glance at it. But if you see it in real life, it's like scary. It gives you a real lens that you really gotta take life to the fullest. You gotta take advantage of life because any day could be your last. Like cause I could have been that car because I was two cars away from it. It could have been me, you know what I'm saying? Anything could have changed that situation. You know what I'm saying? So that's why you just look at life different. And there's no crossing gates at this. I know, it's a crossing sure. gate, but it, I feel like the crossing gate came down late. Because even though it, they said it's supposed to come down like a mile ahead, it didn't come down in time enough. Because that's why cars were still on track. Nobody saw it. And, and were you saying that this is an issue with this intersection here at 31st Street Southwest? Yes, because even the cops said it itself. They said this happens a lot in this area, and it could have been like twice as worse or you know, like this. Because like I said, that that train can't just stop immediately. You know what I'm saying? And like like this, people trying to go to work and all this. And a lot of people hurrying. A lot of cars could have came across us and think they could have beat the train, and it could have been twice as worse. Do you want to say anything else we're not asking you about? Uh, no, I just, just just pray about the family, just give them, lift them up and hope everybody's okay, like I said, and just make sure that we can avoid this by pre preparing to make this city better and all this by making sure that if we see a rail uh, coming up and all that, that we don't just rush and cross it. Just be mindful and think before you, you act. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for talking with oh, us. I'm glad, I'm glad you're okay. You care if we get a little video?